All right, today we're going to look at uh, Wildlife Encyclopedia 10. This is an old, old one from the, I think about 1970, by Funk and Wagnows. And it's got a, looks like a dragonfly on the front. That's really interesting. All right, well, we're going to go through this. We're going to read the names of everything, mostly just look at the pictures. Otherwise, this could go all day. Look at that, there's some koalas. Yeah, cool. Okay, this is called a hydra. The stinging cells. Hydras, like their relatives, the sea anemones and jellyfishes, have stinging cells which capture their prey. Hmm. Interesting. There's inside out hydras. Hmm. There's an ibex. Ibex. That looks like a gazelle. Yeah, it's like a mountain climbing goat sort of thing. Yeah. There it is. And over here is an ibis. It's a form of bird. I don't know much about it. Looks pretty cool though. There's an ice fish. This is ice fish. Mm hmm. It's labeled ice fish. So I'm sure we could look up any of these. We could just Google search any of these names and learn much, much more or read this book, but we're not going to read it today because there's a lot. I'm just going to go through the names. This is a, I don't know how to pronounce this, Enchimon, some kind of a, uh, I think it's like a dragonfly larva of some sort or something. I'm not even sure. Itch Newman. Hmm, very interesting. And here we have Vanishing Iguanas. There's an impala, or three impalas. There's a switchback fugitive. That's interesting. And a widespread buffalo. There's a jacana. That's a different form of bird. Yeah. There's a jackal. There's some more jackals. Um, I don't see the name of these. It's some form of bird. Oh wait, hold on, let me see the name. A jackdaw, gorillas, mm, mandula. There's a jackdaw. And a Jack Dempsey and a Mr. Bear. <laughs> There's a. That's supposed to be the same thing. A Jack Dempsey. <laughs> yeah. Mr. Bear is picky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and a Jack Rabbit. <laughs> Radiator ears, says. <laughs> And a jaguar. And a dog chewing on something she's not supposed to be chewing on. Well, are you what are you chewing on? Okay, we are on jaguar. Pretty sure she's choking on whatever she was chewing on. Yeah, that's why. You're not supposed to chew on random plastic. Cut it out, dog. Alright, there's the jaguar. That's not... This is a leopard. Uh, still jaguar here. Look at jaguar cubs. And there's a jagradini. Jagra jagradi. Not sure how to pronounce that. Jaguarundi. Jagrundi. I don't know. Okay. Well, it's another version of it. Oh, look how cute it is. Look how cool is that? That's a Java sparrow. Why? And there's a J. And there's a jellyfish. A different form of jellyfish. Doesn't say. Look at this jellyfish. Huh? And yeah, more jellyfish. 
Lots of jellyfish. There's a Jeroboa. Okay, and here's a jewelfish. Aw, that's so cute. Yeah, you want to see it again? Yeah. A jewelfish. A jewelfish. I like jewelfish. They're my favorite. They're pretty neat. Yeah. There's a couple more pictures of jewelfish. Oh, more jewelfish. Oh, they're different colors. Mm hmm. And over here we've got a John Dory. And a, oh, here's a jungle fowl. Basically a chicken. Jungle chicken. I don't know, I'm just saying that. Okay, and it says, the four species of jungle fowl are not very closely related to the rest of the peasant family. Interesting. All right, let's see what else we got. Ooh, more jungle fowl. Rapid turnover. When did the fowl become a chicken? So these are chickens. Okay. Before they were domesticated. Oh, butterflies. Uh-huh. These ones are called Kalima. They look like leaves. So it's and trembling itchy. like a leaf. And itchy. I don't know. You probably need to take a shower. They can disappear, apparently. They blend in. Pretty neat, huh? Yeah. See? And right there's one. It looks like a leaf, doesn't it? Yeah. Here's a kangaroo. Or kangaroos. Hmm. I don't know what this is. These are baby kangaroos. Oh. Is this a baby kangaroo? No. It's an older kangaroo. Here's more kangaroos. There's a kangaroo mouse. I did not know there was such a thing. But there they are. How cute is that? Aww, they're so cute. There's a kangaroo rat. Okay, I just noticed the camera was upside down. Sorry about that. There's the kang. There's the kangaroo mouse. There's the kangaroo rat. Here's a Katie did. Oh yeah, we see these everywhere in Ohio. Yeah. Look, they've got frequencies of their sounds in here. That's pretty cool. There's a Kia. K-E-A. Kia. There's a Kestrel. Wow. Some form of Albert, or I don't know what it is, a kestrel. It's a neat looking bird, short beak. A uh, baby, it's a cow bird. Mm, I don't think there's such thing as cow birds. Oh. And see what else we got. Oh, you just said it. Uh, no, I said kestrel. K e s t r e l. Uh, oh, owl bird, some kind of owl. It looks a little bit like an owl, but it's not an owl, I don't think. It's actually, it says, kestrels are small falcons. So it's more of a falcon than it is an owl. And this here is called a kill deer. Uh, common it's a different clover type of, of America, bird. the kill deer, named after its call. It's a different hmm. a type of bird. Yeah. Here's Whoa. a killer whale. Some more killer whales. There's a king crab. Look at that. Whoa. King crabs. They are a living sand plow, it says. Chewing with its legs, coming ashore to breed. Here's a kingfisher. Hmm. That's so weird. Yeah. There he is. Caught a fish. Kingfisher. A bunch more pictures. Mm. They're kind of hard to see. We're going to keep going. There's a king penguin. 
King Penguin. King Penguin. There's a King Snake. And we're not getting into many details of these, but you can always Google these names if you wonder more about them. What is happening there? Hmm. Oh, I thought I had two heads for a second. No, just one head. There's a, I'm not sure how to say that. Kinkajowl? Many local names for the relative of the pandas living on the tropical America. Hmm. There's a kissing gourami. What is a kissing gourami? Oh, looks like they looks like they're kissing. That's probably how they got their name. Oh. There's a kite. What is the kite? A kite is a bird of prey whose smooth gliding flight has given its name to man-made flying devices. Hmm. Decline of the kite. Here's a, uh, let's see, a kittawak, it says. Oh, it's a bird that lives on cliffs. It looks like, hard to see here, but all these white things are little, little birdies. There's one up close. A little dustle. Cool. There's mm. a good picture of one. Looks like they're fighting midair over a piece of food. Huh. Quarreling over food in midair, it says. There's a kiwi. This one is. Yeah, over here is a clip springer. Oh, it's so cute. Yeah. There's a knife fish. Knife fish. What is a knife fish? Yeah. Is it a Called snake? a knife. No, it's a fish. Called a knife fish. Oh, broad and thin. There's a koala. There. Climbing some electric line posts. Probably not very safe, Mr. Koala. There they are. There's a cob, K O B. There's more of them. There's a Komodo dragon. Let's get a nice close up of him. Komodo dragon. Looks like they can swim too. Focus camera. There's a kookaburra. It looks like a gotcha worm. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? A lily long worm. Mm hmm. There he is. Here's a krill. It looks like they live in the ground. Yeah. There's a kudo. It's hard to see, but it's uh, another form of deer or antelope. Or a uh, kudu. I may have said kudo. Largest of the antelopes. Among the largest. Wow, their horns are cool. Look at these wavy horns. Mm -hmm. Antelopes. More kudu. And what's this here? This is a lace wing. What is this? Uh, I think this is just a stem with a bunch of water droplets on it. I'm not sure. I don't think it says. This here is a lace wing. Oh, this kind of bug. It's a lace wing. Oh. There they are in their other phases. There they are. There's more. Over here we have Ladybird's Winter Re Resort. Huh? Oh, okay, these are called ladybirds. Oh. There they are as little larvas. There's some eggs. Yeah. Yeah. Those are eggs. No, the eggs. I drunk all my water. Okay. 
<laughs> Ladybird Farms. Oh, what are those? They're used for insect control, apparently. Oh, this one's so cool. Yeah. And this one's flying weird. Yeah. Well, they didn't have quite as good as cameras as they do now. This was uh, printed in 1970. Or maybe even 1969. Pretty good for then. Some pretty decent photos in here. Right, and we're to the end. Let's see, what was this? This is a, I'm not sure how to say this, Lammergreer. Interesting looking bird. Huge, graceful, and much maligned vulture. Wow. And last but not least, a lamprey. And they look like eels. They're jawless hagfish, it says. Oh, look at that. They're not eels. A lamprey. All right, well, that'll conclude this book. Thanks for looking through Wildlife Encyclopedia 10 with us. And uh, don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Tell us in the comments below which one was your favorite and what, what do you think. And we'll this see you in the next weird. one. Bye-bye. <laughs>